Want to do your eToro taxes fast? Simply import your transactions securely into Coinly and let Coinly calculate your staking, your capital gains and losses, and more accurately and easily. Before we jump in, the information in this video is for educational purposes only and is not tax, financial, or legal advice. Also, the examples I mentioned might not exactly match your situation. So as always, speak to a qualified professional if you're looking for tax advice. Hello, my name is Nelly, and in this updated video, I'm going to show you how to do your eToro taxes. eToro is not only a crypto platform, but one that allows you to trade stocks, ETFs, and commodities. But if you're making sweet gains with eToro, you gotta pay taxes. So Coinly is a crypto tax calculator that can help you do your eToro taxes fast. Now, in order for Coinly to calculate your eToro tax liability, you simply need to import all your transactions into Coinly, which don't worry, is super easy. First step, as always, log into your Coinly account. If you don't have one, you can create one completely free and follow along until the very end. Head over to the wallets area and click on add wallet. Then we wanna type in eToro and there it is. As you can see for this one, there is no API option. We're going to be importing our files using CSVs. So let's click on import from file. Before we jump into the steps, there is an article here about the various um, things that Coinly doesn't support. Like we said, this is not just a crypto platform. It is also a platform for trading ETFs and commodities. And I just wanna go over briefly some of the limitations we have here. So you can export an uh, Excel file from eToro that includes your uh, all your transaction history. This file is supported by Coinly, but some things might be missing. So firstly, um, Coinly supports some common stocks, but most stocks will not be imported. That's because Coinly is a crypto tax calculator. It's not designed for other commodities and assets. And current crypto holdings, this limitation probably is the most annoying one. eToro will report all your closed positions separately from your open positions. So Coinly will import all your closed positions since all the necessary information is provided in the file. Coinly can, however, not import open positions simply due to the fact that the file does not contain necessary information. And in brackets here, we have the purchased amount is missing, only USD amount is reported. This means that your current assets will not be displayed in the wallet. Only USD amount that was spent on the assets will be shown as a holding. So we also talk about how you can fix this problem and it depends kind of on your country. So most countries will only tax your closed positions, AKA your realized gains. So your open positions will not be considered for uh, tax purposes. Some countries do actually tax your current holdings. So if that's the case in your country, then you should add the missing purchases. So we have an entire article on how you would add transactions manually, which I will also leave down below. And you can of course add purchases if you want to see your current holdings for portfolio tracking purposes. And lastly, transfers to the eToro wallet are reported as uh, withdrawals. This is something we are aware of and will hopefully fix in the near future. This happens because the eToro file will actually report this as a sale and the USD amount received from that sale uh, will be reported as being withdrawn. And you can fix this by editing the sale of your crypto and deleting the received part by clicking on the small trash icon. As you can see, we have a picture here and an example of how you would do that. So this will change the transaction into a withdrawal and you can then delete the withdrawal of the USD if necessary. Okay, so we've gone over that. Let's talk about the actual method of importing your data. So let's head over to our eToro account. Okay, so on eToro, we want to go to portfolio. And then from this drop down menu where it says my portfolio, we want to click on history. And then in the top right corner, there is a little gear icon. We want to click on that and we want to click on account statement. From here, we want to select something like um, all of last year, let's say. Obviously, make sure to include your entire transaction history. Um, it might require several files, although it doesn't look like there's a limitation on you know what date range you can select. You could probably select all of it in one file, but in case you can't, you might have to import multiple files. That's not really a big deal. So I'm just gonna do last year, all of 2023, and I'm gonna click on create. In the top right corner now, we will be given our um, file. There's a PDF option and an XLS. That is the one we want. We do not want the PDF one. So let's click on that. Then simply take that downloaded file, drag and drop it into Coinly and click import. And there you have it. Now we can head over to our transactions and just make sure underneath the hood, make sure everything is sitting correctly with you. Your staking transactions have been tagged correctly. Send to pool, send from pool. Um, double check everything and make sure 
you're happy with what you see. Okay, if you've traded on other exchanges and wallets, which you probably have, you're gonna wanna repeat this simple process and connect them all. Luckily, Coinly integrates with over 850 platforms. And if you ever need a hand, we upload new integration videos weekly. So now with all your transactions imported into Coinly, we are able to view all your crypto transactions to accurately calculate your capital gains, losses, and income from crypto. This also includes DeFi's, airdrops, staking, etc. If you have done any staking or liquidity providing, then you may need to tag those transactions manually. And like I mentioned earlier, I will leave a link to our staking and liquidity videos down below and in the top right corner of this video. Okay, now you can head over to the Coinly Reports page and you can see how your year stacks up with a free summary showing your crypto totals for the year. The summary is awesome, but to officially file your taxes, you're gonna need a lot more detail. So now for the best part. Coinly produces a stack of cryptocurrency tax reports that cover your year's activity in great detail. This includes calculations and totals that line up with how the tax man wants it. We support over 1 million investors around the world with reports like the IRS Schedule D and Form 8949, plus a report for TurboTax, Tax Act, the UK, Australia, Canada, France, and a complete tax report for just about everyone else. Simply buy a plan from Coinly and download your report. You can file your taxes yourself, or if you work with an accountant, you can share it. Or you can even invite them to your account to Coinly. Lastly, check your country's rules and regulations because this report might be deductible. I will leave a bunch of resources down below if you need further assistance with our product. If you found this video helpful, consider dropping a like, subscribing for more crypto content. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below or on our forum section where our users and Coinly support team are ready to jump in.